Working in intensive care, I wept behind my mask as three children talking to their dying mother on an iPad begged her to wake up. Countless children now growing up without parents, while parties were held at number 10. It is an insult to everyone who wasn't allowed to say their final goodbye. This happened on the Prime Minister's watch. My question is very simple. How does the Prime Minister sleep at night? understand and share the anger up and down the country at seeing number 10 staff seeming to make light of lockdown measures. And I can understand how infuriating it must be to think that the people who have been setting the rules have not been following the rules, Mr Speaker, because I was also furious to see that clip. And Mr Speaker, I apologise. I apologise unreservedly for the offence that it has caused up and down the country, and I apologise for the impression that it gives. But I have been repeatedly assured since these allegations emerged that there was no party and that, and that no COVID rules were broken, that if those rules were broken, then there will be disciplinary action for all those involved. My remarks seemed to make light of the rules. Rules that people were doing everything to obey. That was never my intention. I will regret those remarks for the rest of my days and now for my profound apologies to all of you at home for them. Mm -hmm.